Hello everyone and welcome to my stockpile. This is room number one. There actually is a room with laundry care and cleaning products. So we'll get to that in just a little bit. Um, first up, I wanna mention this is a collab video this week. I am collabing with three other new up and coming YouTubers. Kelsey B Saves, Mama Big Coupons, and Financial Phoenix. They're all three newer channels who I contacted and said, hey, I'm gonna do a stockpile tour. How about we do a collab where we all do stockpile tour videos and um, we help each other out. So I will have down in the description box below links to all three of their channels. They have the stockpile tour video up at the same time as me. So you can go right now and binge watch our stockpile tours. And I'm sure we all do things differently. So that way we can all get inspiration on how to organize. So go check them out and let's just dive right in. Okay, so it's a little bit different than when you last saw the stockpile because there's this big thing in the middle. This is an old arm wire thing, had a mirror on it, a dresser rather, um, that we repurposed and have put here in the middle of the stock room. This is a shared storage room. Um, so there's a lot to it. So let's just dive right in. But the stockpile is sl like slowly taking over this entire room. It's up here I have mouthwash. Now I have a little bit of less of some things as I have done a big clear out. And I'm going to clear out some more things, too, because I just have a lot. I'm going to have all this mouthwash. I'm um, here. I have all my lotion, which I still want more lotion because that's not that much. I'm um, here. It's just like facial products. Up here is various body wash. I really need a body wash. I have lots of kids. Oh, this is kids two and one um, and body wash. But I need more body wash in my stockpile. Down here are hair styling products. I definitely need more of those too. A little Lonely Kid Zyrtec. I don't know why that's there. A little hairbrush set. These were free at Kroger like last year. Here is some Pantene and other various masks and hair ties. And my grandma picked this up at the Dollar Tree. I, I don't know why, but she found it. It's a toolbox and she's like, I think this would be good for the stockpile. So yeah, this is for five people as well. Six actually, six on a regular basis. My cousin comes like all the time and grabs stuff. So this is really supporting a lot of people, like at least nine people on a regular basis. My grandparents use it, a lot of people. Okay, here's more body wash. I don't really know why we have it set up like that, but whatever. Um, down here are feminine wipes, shaving creams, and that is all hand soap. I'm loving that hand soap deal. Love it. Sorry if you hear a little weird noises. This is a basement, so. Here is various overflow condiments. We keep a lot of the food upstairs. These are just a bunch of overflow that I got to clear out and donate. That is heavy. Here are various things. Oh, car plugins and these glades. Down there is all that water loose, sparkling water that's been free. I'm at Kroger. Then up here, sorry, this is a little tight corner, so it's how it works. Okay, we have all of these men's hair products. All these are men's hair products. And then here's my styling products, my hair gel. Yeah, that's a lot. And I even got rid of a lot, but it's still a lot. Here are women's hair products. These are one of the things I always have went crazy stockpiling. And I'm really glad I did because now we don't get like L'Oreal coupons anymore. We don't get Garnier coupons. So yeah, we'll never get those again. Okay, and then down here are all of my wet wipes, Kleenex wipes. This is full, so I don't need any more of those. Um, in here are all those diapers from Walmart and Baby Formula. I gotta clear those out as well. Okay, now let's talk about this arm wire thing or dresser. I have two of these big storage tubs. I sit on the top and down here are all sorts of drawers. So let me show you what is in here first. This isn't really that exciting, but this is stuff. It, it, we just redid this room, so it's kind of still. Okay, just notebooks. This is all notebooks. I went crazy stocking up and some folders. Years ago, I went crazy stocking up on that stuff. So yeah, over here, we also keep this thing of Crystal Light and True Lemon. We just drink these a lot, so when I go 99 cents or less, I stock up. And then in here is lots of food, pasta, various snacks, cereal, stuff like that. This is kind of bad, but um, yeah, this is the overflow. Oh, and the drawers, you might want to see those. 
These are all three school supply items and that Kiwi Chew polish. I didn't know where else to put. So these are all ink pens. Uh, and I keep those lighters in here that we got for free. I don't know why I do that. In here is a very messy little miscellaneous drawer I need to go through. Here are trial size products. And in here are light bulbs and batteries and flashlights. In here is denture products. I have family who uses those. They're not going to waste. In here are more light bulbs because they just we need light bulbs all the time. Um here are facial products, sunscreen, Q-tips, lip balm, all those Neutrogena bars. And then down here is baby powder and baby bars. Tons of that stuff. Okay, so let me take you over here. Sorry. This is toilet paper from my great uncle that he bought. That he just doesn't have room to store in his apartment. So he wrote his name all over it so no one uses that. Very low on paper towels. Gotta get some paper towels back. I'm um, very low. Okay, this is um, a pack of paper towels that's open. These are flushable wipes that were on a really good deal. Um, those are for my great uncle. We don't use those usually. Um, boost for him, secret wipes, nothing. This is kind of stuff that my um, certain family members use. It's already opened. Okay, toothpaste. Toothpaste stock has seen better days. Um, I did a huge clear out and toothpaste was like one of the main things that went. Here are toothbrushes and floss. Lots of that stuff. Here are women's razors. And it doesn't look like there's a lot, but truly, this goes down pretty deep. I'd love to get more though. Um, and like I said, my grandparents keep their stuff here as well. So, wow, all this stuff is, all these labels are falling off. So maybe these were not the best choice. Um, to put here. Sorry. My OCD won't let that look like that in the video. Here's all my men's razors. Lots of men's razors. Men's deodorant. Yeah, that's doing pretty well. Um, ladies deodorant could definitely do better. I have a ton of Thermacare. This is all Thermacare. Okay, these are cold. All cold medicines, cough drops, nasal spray. And down here is every other kind of medication. This Definitely should be in more bins, but it's all good. All right, so here is all of my freezer and all those bags I just got on that deal at Kroger. Like, love it. Love that. That is awesome. This is on top of a wardrobe style thing, as you can see all the hangers, but we have a top to it. And so it's in the storage room, so it's going here. All right, so there's all our toilet paper. This should last us a very, very long time. Here is also all our dish soap. And I never usually have this much dish soap, but the, you know, these have been free on Shopkick like crazy. Those seventh gen generation ones were like 37 cents. So I've gone crazy and stocked up on dish soap again. So that's awesome. Now I'm gonna take you all over into the laundry stockpile and show you all that. All right, so here's the laundry stock. Um, there actually is this little dresser first. That has not been reorganized, so let me show you all that. Um, okay, I know. I'm so sorry. I have a bunch of Febreze still, a ton of Febreze. Here I have all my scent beads. I still would like to rework it, but there's no other room. Like, this is it. Down there are all those renews it thingies and scrubbing bubbles. So, yeah, I really would like to have that stuff all up here, but there's just not room. I have so much other cleaning products um, right now. So let's talk up here is all my laundry detergent. I counted about, let's count right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. I have 23 on this top shelf. So that's already a lot. This is all my all, um, there's more all back there. All is a very big brand I've always been able to get for cheap. Per sale is awesome. We always get that for cheap. Oxy, not as much as we used to in Arm & Hammer. Arm & Hammer stopped giving coupons on paper coupons in our area. A bunch of Tide, and I'm still waiting to fill it up with more. You might be thinking, Nick, how do you get so many duplicates? So, like, see all these four down in wrinkle release. It reset two times on my Ivata. Um, as I've explained before, I helped my grandparents coupon. The stockpile is all kept here. They can't, I mean, like... My and my great uncle stuff, he can't fit it in his apartment, so it all comes here to our house as a general stock. So, if you see doubles, 
that's why it's a shared stockpile. Um, here's all my tied. And then here are my pods. These are Todd pods, all pods. This is filled with the Arm & Hammer pods that were like, never pay more than a dollar for these at Family Dollar. I always stock up. And then the purse sale. Okay, what's on the bottom? Toilet bowl cleaner. This has seen better days. Definitely seen better days. Um, the disposal cleaners, that's a prime example of how uh, my grandparents get it on their account and they keep it here. And then mine's in there. And then over there it says Glade Warmers. Swiffer Dusters. Dish products, love that, love those. And then the Mr. Clean Erasers that have been going on like crazy. Um, let's come up here, Downy Wrinkle Release. There's one little Febreze Odor Eliminator and all these Carbona Stain Devils. Fabric Softener and Dryer Sheets, love it. And then here's my cleaner. So here I have like Shout. This is an oldie um, that they just had a long time ago. So it's just in the front. Windex, Disinfecting Cleaner. These were like 79 cents at Kroger. Stain remover, um, this is all purpose cleaners. And then these are like, I don't know, like the mopping stuff. I don't know what it is, but they do. So that's all that matters. Oh, and I have a very, very small tissue stock here. Um, I, I need a deal on these, like ASAP, but they are double stacked, so that's good. Um, but yeah, that is my stockpile. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Um, I am really happy with how it looks. I really could go without shopping for a while, but odds are that's not going to happen, at least not now. So, yeah, that's all I have for this video. Check out Financial Phoenix, Mama Big Coupons, and Kelsey B Saves series, or, um, special videos for their stockpiles. Like I said, we collabed, so we all would get our stockpile tours up for y'all at the same time. Four tours. This is definitely going to give you some, all, some good inspiration about your stockpile. So thank y'all so much for watching.